Hi kids! Today we will learn what are the basic needs of living things. So let's start! Living things need some basic things. That is, air to breathe, water to drink, food to eat, shelter to live. Let's learn all the basic needs of living things, one by one. First one is air to breathe. Kids, when we take in air from our nose or mouth, it is called breathing in. And when we take out air from our nose or mouth, it is called breathing out. Kids, we cannot hold our breath for long. That is, we cannot live without breathing. We, that is, humans, breathe through our nose. And we can also breathe through our mouth. Now let's see other animals. Dogs. Do they breathe? Yes, they breathe as they are living things. They also breathe through their nose. Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects. Now, here is a cat. Does she breathe? Yes, cats do breathe. Cats also breathe through their nose. So animals breathe through their nose and can also breathe through their mouth. Now, fish is a living thing. Does it breathe? Yes, fish too breathe. Fish breathe through its gills. That is, fish have gills to breathe. Plants too are living things. Do they breathe? Yes, plants too breathe, and they breathe through tiny pores on leaves called stomata. We will learn more about it in higher grades. So kids, we learned that all living things need air to live. Living things cannot live without air, which is necessary for breathing. Now let's see another thing, which is a basic need of living things. Water to drink. Kids, do you drink water? Yes, and so many times a day. All living things need water to stay healthy. Do you water plants at home? Or your mom and dad gives water to plants. It is because plants too need water. All plants need water to make their food. Water enters the plants through its roots and then travels through tiny tubes in the stem to its upper part. That is, all the leaves, branches, and stems. Let's see this with an example. Here we had some white colored flowers and empty containers. We added some edible colors to water. Now keep them for a few days. After a few days, petals of each flower show the color added to its water. Flowers with pink water have pinkish tint and flowers with yellow water have yellowish tint. All flowers have some shade which is added to their water. That shows that water travels up the plant. All the plants, animals, and all of us need water to live. So water is one of the basic needs of all living things. Now let's learn another basic need of living things. 
food to eat. We all eat food, don't we? Yes, we eat food, whatever we like daily, so many times a day, and also give food to our pets. We also give food to our plants. Food for plants is water and some nutrients from the soil, and we add water and manure to soil as food for plants. We give water and manure to the plants, which is their food. Food gives energy to all the living things to do work. If we don't eat food, we will fall sick, and we will not have the energy to do any work, or play, and enjoy. Also, food makes us grow big and strong. Now let's learn about another basic need of living things. That is shelter to live. All the living things need their home or shelter. Where do you live? You live in your home. That's your shelter. If it's very cold outside, you cannot survive for long outside, as you need warmth, and that is provided by your home. Or when it's raining outside, you cannot stand outside for long. You need your shelter. That is your home. You feel comfortable at your home. You have all the things you need only at your home. Every animal too needs his shelter. If it's very cold outside, or hot outside, or raining outside, animals need their shelter. So we make a shelter for our pets too. Like this is a small house for a cat, and this is a kennel for a dog. This is a coop for hen. Likewise, birds make their own nests to live. That's their home or shelter. Fish live in a pond or aquarium at our home. That's their shelter or home. So every living animal needs a shelter, which is their home. Our shelter or our home protects us from heat, cold, wind, and rain. We feel safe and comfortable at our home. So, kids, we learned the basic needs of living things: air, water, food, and shelter. Now, go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye bye.